The year 2022 has been quite a busy one for the officers and men of the CGC Strike Balls headquarters. From April 2022 till date, the team made seizures of various illicit items in Abuja, Mina, and Para states, which include 43 detained vehicles, 99 bags of foreign purple rice, and 19 giant bales of secondhand clothing, all with a total duty paid value of 504 million naira. The coordinator, Deputy Comptroller Kolapo Oladiji, highlighted the importance of the unit. CGC Strike Force. It's like intervention unit. So checkmates, whatever escape, maybe from seaports or the border areas. So I don't want to escape us. We complement the effort of various commands so that that lost revenue will be paid. The coordinator also highlighted that even with various challenges, including attacks on his officers, they will continue to frustrate the efforts of these economic saboteurs. What can we, 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 we cannot leave small class to triumph, especially under this present management who has been doing credibly well for the improvement of revenue generation and enforcement of customs laws. With time, the society will recognize that the revenue the service is generating is meant for their benefit and smuggling doesn't pay. He appreciated the continued support of the Comptroller General of Customs, Colonel Hamid Ali retired, along with his management team, for providing an enabling environment and pledged to sustain this tempo in the execution of the Nigeria Customs Service mandates. Abdul Karim Zermi, NCBN, Abuja.